Hey everyone, welcome back. Lucklight here, and we're continuing Final Fantasy III for the NES. And we're entering the Tower of the Dragoons. Where, uh, Dragoons really didn't become super, super important until Final Fantasy IV, the next one, with uh, our old buddy Kane. This one uh, provided Dragoons as a job class to take. And we're gonna need it for the next uh, fight, so we need to go up up this tower and procure ourselves some valuable weapons and armor so that we can do that without being horribly weak at it. And actually, I take that back. Uh, dragoons were also important in Final Fantasy II for the NES. Uh, there was a dragoon NPC that I almost forgot about. Sorry about that. Named Ricard. Uh, Final Fantasy 2 is kind of a speck in my memory. I don't really, I haven't really played it as much as I should have. Maybe I'll come to that someday. Uh, which way? Oh, right through here. This place is a very strange maze. Full of enemies. Now, uh, in between episodes, I did buy a few of those weapons uh, because I. You kind of need to to have two weapons on everybody. Or else you're just gonna get enough to have one spear on everybody. And while that may be enough for some people, not enough for me. So, I bought four spears. <laughs> I also went to the Fat Chocobel and dumped uh, some of my uh, status recovery items so that uh, when I do equip all the Dragoon stuff, I don't, you know, run out of space and not be able to do so. So, did a little bit of cleanup and a little bit of, you know, non essential work in between episodes. So, once these guys die, we can move on. I'm gonna go this way. And around. That's a whole lot just to get to one area. Oh, of course I'm ambushed. And unfortunately running away does that stupid defenseless thing, so let's fight them. down will be all dragoons, so things will die faster, hopefully. Another reason I don't switch now is because I have no weapons. And, well, I have weapons, I have no armor to really make them not get their butts kicked. And really, by the end of this, I'll probably only have one dragoon. After all is said and done. Although I should compare the stats between the knight and a dragoon, see if they're... which one's better. Alright, so... here's the top. Dragon armor, thunder spear, dragon armor, thunder spear, phoenix down, dragon helmet. And still enemies. More of these jerks. Yes, please die. Oh great, poison. And I think antidotes were one of the things I dropped off. <laughs> Just my luck. So it looks like we're not switching completely to Dragoon. Oh, 
but I did find some black holes. Yep, I dropped off my antidotes. Alright, so let's start switching out. Start with him. It's gonna take me uh, quite a bit of uh, capacity as well. So, dragon helmet, dragon armor. I don't think dragon gauntlets are a thing. Or gauntlets at all. I should wait until I level up. Let's head back down. Oh, great, another ambush. And what I was saying was, uh, I'm about to level up, so... I kinda wanna keep roll at, a uh, Karateka. That way he gets the most hit points. before I switch out. One more fight and I'll level. Oh jeez, everything is an ambush. This is kinda BS. How am I being ambushed by every monster in the place? <laughs> characters looking at the floor as they walk. Well, technically we are, aren't we? I gotta be careful because, if I remember correctly, Katobal passes are uh, stone-inducing, at least in mythology. D-E-D dead. <laughs> Levels up. Still trying to get out of here. And around, and up. I think down here, no. Down here. This way. No, I didn't get uh, ambushed this time. That's good. And since I do most of my leveling as a Karateka on all four characters, there's gonna hit a point where switching to one is gonna be free and I'm just gonna break face <laughs> every time I do it. So maybe at some point in this game there will be a point where I uh, have four of those. So yeah, this is to trick you. Alright, we're out. So let me go ahead and switch up. I need to remove everything. Wrong character. And you can see that I'm pretty much full up on stuff. That's why I removed some things. Alright, so switch to Dragoon. Uh, 
have four dragoons now. Go ahead and equip everything. I'm gonna give him the wind spears, because I think he's gonna be the one who stays a dragoon later. Uh, dragoon. Where's my dragon armor? Did I miss it? Yeah. And it looks like he can use a gauntlet, so. Boop. Might as well keep that on. So, Thunder Spear. Thunder Spear. Dragon Helmet. Dragon Armor. I don't think there's anything else for the hands I can use. And for him, Thunder Spear. Thunder Spear. Dragon Helmet. Dragon Armor. Alright, so I'm fully stocked with four dragoons. And they look pretty pretty cool. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. So what we're gonna do is not that. Is we're gonna head over to the inn. We're gonna heal up. We're gonna save our game. Because this could go wrong. This could go very wrong. Now our target is that I want to do this keeping all four characters alive. If the enemy, if the boss gets a turn before everybody gets up in the air, because I have to use jump, chances are one of them's going to die, and that then the boss will not die that first turn, and I could get wrecked even farther. So it all it's all determined by speed. Go ahead and save that. Let's see how well we do. If I don't do it the first time, then we'll do it on the next episode. <laughs> You've been banished. Alright, so even though he's been banished, he's allowed to come in. That's good. Please rest here in what looks like a hallway. <laughs> Are you asleep yet? No. Don't you love me? <laughs> what kind of parents don't love their children? Bad parents. Oh no, scary king music. And there's that goof. Stab! And apparently he stabbed himself. <laughs> Wait, fight us instead. Legendary well, winged monster Garuda. So let's do it. Jump. After all this preparation. Jumping up. Jumping up. And he nailed two of my guys. Alright, it wasn't that bad. It's not, not bad. A lot more worse than the remake. So boom. 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 And boom. Let's do it again. Jump. Jump. Ouch. Feels like random damage. And we got him. Everybody's alive. Good. I can cut all my capacity back good, too. 
All right, so I think that'll do it. On the next episode, we'll pick up right where we left off, and uh, we'll find out what happened here and if the king's going to make it. And if not, uh, we'll, we'll see what we can do next. Either way, hope you join me for that. My name is Lucklight, thank you for watching, and have a good one.